Hello YouTube, welcome back to the channel. We're getting ready right now to go do some trash picking. But first, um, the other day we went and did some thrifting. And got a few items. I'm going to show you those right now. And then we're going to go do some, do some trash picking stuff. Let's look at those items real quick. Okay, so there's not a whole, whole lot. Um, first off, look at this painting picked this up i thought this was some store-bought like item and it might be but i'm not sure it actually looks like somebody painted it like they bought the canvas themselves and then painted it we actually found that in the trash somebody threw that away it's really cool though it's a castle with a i don't know that's just really nice then we found this uh, crocodile hunter game lauren paid a dollar for this pretty cool i think it was like 1996 um, I found this joystick for like a flight simulator type game. It's all in there, still has the, the manuals and everything. I only paid a dollar for it. It's a good deal. Um, found Lucas a pair of play shoes at a thrift store and a couple of articles of clothing. Some pajamas. And this is a really cool shirt. You guys know we like our video games. It's a Mario Kart for the Wii shirt. Got a couple of video games myself here. Fable for the original Xbox, and then a Tony Hawk game, and then the uh, Sports Resort. If you ever guys ever come across these, um, always try to pick these up, especially if they're cheap enough. These right here sell for about 25 to 30 bucks. And the only other thing here is I got this uh, tripod. I don't know if I think I already guess I already took the sticker off. I paid three dollars for this. Let's see if we can open it up. But it was all new. It's a uh, what do they call that? Squid grip tripod, but it's got everything with it. I'm actually going to use this today here in a little bit when we go do our picking. So pretty cool. So the only other thing that we bought of note is this, um, I bought this guitar. It's a rock band guitar for the Xbox 360. I asked the guy if it worked and he told me that he didn't know. The only reason why he bought it is so he could hang it up on his wall. It was at a flea market. Of course, you're going to say anything to make a sale. But I asked him, you know, how much? And he told me, I think he told me like eight bucks. And I said, well, without you knowing it works, do you mind taking five? And he, he said five was fine. Which for five bucks, I'll take a gamble because these are like going for like $40 in used condition, which this one is. It's got some stuff. All this can be cleaned up. Um, it's not broken or anything. The whammy bar is actually in good shape. So for 40 bucks, we'll take a chance on it and see if it works. Anyway, I guess for now, let's go try to find some cool stuff in the trash. Pulled up over here to this uh, easel. This is actually an item that we want to get uh, Lucas for Christmas, but that one's broken pretty bad, so we're going to have to pass on that one. It's a nice one. Yeah. So we made it up here to our little neighborhood, and I did forget to mention that my dad does have a truck today. He's borrowing my truck, so we're in the car. So... Hopefully no huge stuff, but we'll see. For the desktop. Look. It's in there? Looks like it, huh? Okay, we'll take it. You got it or you grab it? I'll let you grab it. So that's pretty cool. It looked like it was a, uh, Lauren said desktop surround zone. I haven't really looked at it yet. I know it's heavy, so it feels like it's all in there. Been doing kind of not so great. We're a little early, earlier than normal, so we haven't found a whole lot. But that will definitely make up for it. So we've got a little ways to go, though. It's a little doghouse and a barbecue. It's a doghouse. I'm pretty sure. I don't know. It's, it's got a little door over here. Look, it's, it's like. Oh, yeah. 
I'll take it. So. Can't take the grill. Is that a scooter any good? So we pulled up here to Sonic to grab some, some drinks. Lauren's getting her cherry lime made. I'm gonna get me some hot chocolate. Question of the video. Do you guys have a preference for holiday drinks? Um, eggnog or or whatever it may be. What do, what do you guys like to drink that you might only drink like around the holidays? Do you have anything growing up that you guys... Yeah, it's just hot chocolate. Mostly just hot chocolate. It's kind of a cold weather drink though, right? Yeah. So, I don't know. I know my uh, my cousin, Greg, he, he's, uh, he's a real big eggnog guy. So, I don't know. What do you guys, what do you guys like to drink mostly around the holidays? So I didn't even know that Sonic served hot chocolate. It was just kind of a whim. We just kind of guessed. Um, there's no Starbucks, Starbucks in our area. So Sonic it is. Smells good. Took the lid off to let it cool off a little bit. And there's no marshmallows in here. Come on, Sonic. Not one marshmallow. Not even any little ones. Nothing. So there's a... Uh little car seat there in bad shape and then one of those um like ottomans like the one we got at the house mm -hmm. you know with that but it's ripped up it's leather so that's it looks like your hot chocolate's doing to the windshield hey maybe it'll cool off quicker <laughs> so no marshmallows but it is at least tasty and uh, in that pile there, I, I grabbed a little TV. I'll show you all that here in a little bit. No cord, but I've got plenty of cords. So here's that surround sound again. Um, it's like a, um, for like computers, you know, for a computer surround sound or your laptop or desktop or whatever. I'm, I'm sure you can use it for your TV too, but everything worked i already taped it back up i wish that i hadn't i wish i could have, or i should have turned it on and uh, showed you guys but i put everything back in uh, wrapped the cords up because this is actually going to go to someone as a christmas present i mean it was in perfect working shape um there was absolutely nothing wrong with it they're pretty cool they go for about a hundred bucks um here it is if you want to look it up yourself <laughs> but yeah, really awesome. So I think I had also mentioned that I had grabbed a couple of TVs, probably off camera. I can't remember if I got them on camera or not. They were little TVs, um, 20 inch, probably 19, 20 inch, something like that. They were small. Um, I just grabbed them because they were small and if they didn't work, they would be easy to dispose of. Um, fit right inside of uh, one of my trash cans. So, um they didn't work neither one of them <laughs> which it's expected but like i said they were easy to uh dispose of the only other thing really to note is this house me and lauren was talking about it and i was wondering let's see what they have on here it just says Oh, meow, meow, sir. I guess for it was this was for a cat. I never read that. What I initially thought that it might have been for a um, some rabbits or something. I don't know. I think what we're gonna do with it though is I might take these little doors off or leave them. I'm not sure yet, but um, repaint it and actually maybe put some um, shingles on the top of it and then resell it that way i'm not sure maybe just maybe just sell it just like this i don't know somebody can do something with it <laughs> it's really cool though whoever did it whoever made it uh, did a pretty good job on it i'll have to get rid of this dirt dauber nest though not bad 
so not a whole lot going on as far as the trash bagging but here in a little bit i'm going to pick lucas up from school and he wants to go do something he wants to go um explore an abandoned house there's a house kind of in our neighborhood that he wants to go check out we always pass by it and he always asks if he can go into it i've been into it before maybe even on camera i can't remember but anyway so we're gonna go we're gonna go check it out um i'm gonna take him in there and just kind of let him look around hopefully it's not too uh too in too bad a shape uh we'll be careful um i know that it is it's way too cold so anything that might have been living in there um bees and spiders and even maybe snakes and stuff everything is going to be dormant and it should be fine so we're going to go take a look at this little this house and if you guys want to come hang out with us more than welcome to if not that's the end of the trash picking and thrifting and all that kind of good stuff but otherwise let's get into that all right so we just got the little guy out of school you want to tell him where we're going haunted house it's a haunted house yeah but isn't that going to be real scary <laughs> no are you sure there's no one living in there but if it's haunted what does, what does that mean it means no one lives in it you think it means maybe it's abandoned yes abandoned abandoned house you know aaron used to call it dilapidated no. You say dilapidated? Dilapidated. Yep. Is it, is it dilapidated? Mm-hmm. Yeah. So I don't know a whole lot about this house. All I know is that it was, it's was it been abandoned. I think that we found either a calendar or something, but the date was like 1993. I could be wrong. It could be a little earlier than that. Anyway, if it was 93, that's what? 30 years, 30 years ago almost <clears throat> but anyway let's go check it out it's a at one time this was a really really nice house um it's got a huge porch really cool like entryway living room type situation um the last time that i was in this house a big portion of the house was inaccessible so we're not gonna be able to go to like the garage there's this big hallway in the back of the house with with a huge closet and like storage closet and a bathroom we're not going to be able to make it to. And then a huge bedroom. I'll be able to show you the room, but we're not going to be able to go into it. Why? Because it's bad. It's in bad shape, or it was. Okay. It's probably in worse shape by now. Can, but, can I go up the stairs? Yeah, we're, well, we're gonna. I'll show you. We'll, we'll see. We'll together what we can go look at. Okay. Let's go do it. Yeah, let's get out. So we're going to go into the haunted house. You tell us anything about this house? No. Who used to live there? I don't know. You don't know? No. You think it's a good idea to go in this place? Uh, yeah, I think so. What if we get scared? I don't, I don't know if we will. Will you protect me? Yeah. Are you a good fighter? <laughs> no. Oh, no. <laughs> can you help me? Yeah, I'll, I'll help you. I'll protect you. Okay. Here it is. You can kind of see it back here in the in the tall bushes and trees and weeds and stuff okay what's that sign say um that's like a sign for like a the mayor <laughs> this is the walkway what? like where you're stepping okay check out this awesome porch Oh, oh, be, watch your step. I mean, let me go first. See, look over there. The floor is already gone. I see. Oh, yeah. Hey, get scoot back. Why? Because I don't want you to fall through. Look at the roof. Oh, yeah. Hey, you're the Yeah, I got the camera rolling right now. I want to stay behind me, okay? Not sure. Come on. There's an old piano there. Come on. Okay, go slow. So this is actually, for some reason, somebody's kind of like cleaned up in here. Yeah. 
this the last time I was in here it was like full of just trash on Whoa. the floor the piano had been knocked over look a, look a mop there's a mop right there the TV's like in place <laughs> hey hey that can get really old come on okay. hey, well. alright so this is the front door I want you to check this out imagine um, when the house was like nice where would you put the Christmas tree because Christmas is almost up. If this was your house, where would you put a Christmas tree at? Uh, I'll put it hey, up this was my room. I'll put my little Christmas tree right there. Right there? I was thinking maybe right over there where that piano is at. Big old Christmas tree in the corner with all the presents. That'd be really cool. You got the fireplace over here. Really nice fireplace at one time. Yeah. Stay right there. Because look, the floor's falling in. It's let me go up here, take a look up here. Could put some pictures up on the mantle. Yeah, but what? With a roaring fire. Hey, look, the, the sun is like going through the, in here. I know it. Yeah, but this was, like, this was, this was a very nice house. At one time, huh? Yeah. Man, hey, those the, are heavy. What are those? I'm not sure. Weights of some kind. Old tea thing or coffee that, pot. There's the kitchen. And where's the kitchen? It's back in the back. Oh. Let's see. Hold on. I want you to stay right there, okay? Why? Because I want to look in here first and make sure it's safe. It's safe? It looks like it might be safe. Come on. Except for that corner over there. So you can see the roof up here is just, it's gone. Rains came through the window and just the floor is just gone. Stay right there, okay? But just imagine it. You know, back in the day, look how cool the ceiling is. With the beams and stuff up there. Big light. Huge dining room table in here. Having everybody over for dinner. I look that over there for now. I see that. Hey, hold on, let me go first, okay? Yeah, go first now. Okay, you just follow me. Sure this is safe. Yeah, because I don't want you to get hurt. You don't want me to fall through the floor. I sure don't. You don't want me to fall. A little fall. hallway here. Hey, it don't look kind of safe. Stay right there, okay? Don't come in this little room. Because it's dark. I want you to stay right there for right now. This used to be the little room. I think that this might have been a bedroom. There's a couch in here. That room back there is the one I was telling you about. We'll walk in here here in just a second, okay? Let's go this way. A Looks like it's all safe here. Go ahead and go through. Hey, look. There's a secret room. That's the attic. There's the attic. Check this out. <laughs> Some duct tape on it. Oh, how safe that is. Hold on, stay right there, okay? Looks like somebody's like cleaning this thing out a little bit and used it as a clubhouse or something. I'm gonna stole all the copper wires. I found a bathroom. There's a bathroom. Yeah, I found a bathroom. Stay right here, okay? A very look, small bathtub. They, they look, that, that window got smashed. I know it. That's because this house is so old. Kind of surprising that there's such a small bathroom in such a big, nice house. Stay right there, stay right there. Yep, it's safe. Do you let me go first? See, the last time I was in here, which was a long time ago, all this was just crap all over the floor. Here's the big kitchen. That's the doorway that led into that dining room. Mm -hmm. They look at the floor. Right? I know, it's starting to kind of what? rip up. So that's the washroom, laundry room big cabinet with a sink but you could just see the house is okay, okay. crumbling okay. what does that used to be uh that's it goes into the dining room no, but somebody must have been doing some work in here i wonder what's going on what the deal is okay, this was the oven yep that was the oven yeah. let's go take a look in here and see what's going on in this room it's 
stay right there. With this, hey, daddy, safe. God, that does definitely doesn't look safe. You scoot back. <laughs> There's a lot of the trash. Daddy. Don't get too close. Yeah. Okay, step back back here for just a second. So, I do want to apologize about the constant bark of that dog. The room that I was telling you about that has the bathroom and the hallway and the garage and stuff, it leads back there. Um, you can kind of see it back here right back there's the garage there's that huge closet and then I think this is the bathroom and this is just one another huge bedroom leads to the outside just on the other side of that door is where the chimney's at and this place has a huge well had a huge backyard I mean it goes way back so come on little munchkin Oh, you, let me go first and so I can make sure this floor's safe. Hold on. A little walkway to, oh, that's a closet that they ripped out the, uh, the wall there. Can I go now? Yeah, come on. Back into that room. Just let me go first. Used to be. That's a couch. Oh, but what does this room used to be? Um, probably somebody's bedroom. So it looks like it had that might have been a bedroom back there. Kind of set up weird. Bedroom maybe in the back. This is the bedroom. That maybe have been a bedroom. Living room. Then the dining room on the side. The kitchen. I don't know. This is one time was a really cool house. Um back when I was younger I used to actually get up into the attic and get onto the roof and I'd hang out with friends and stuff up there I don't know it's just weird that somebody's actually been here like cleaning in here very strange but anyway that's gonna do it for us I hope you guys like the house um, this abandoned house it's like I said probably 30 years abandoned you can see all the way that middle room and then that room back there to the kitchen just at one time, really cool house. You want to say anything? Bye. Thanks for hanging out with us or anything? Thanks for hanging out with us. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks. All right, guys. We're going to look around a little Thanks. bit more, and uh, I guess we'll see you all next time.